Those with a nervous disposition, look away now, because I'm about to clean this motorcycle with a pressure washer. Okay, I know this is gonna rustle a few Jiminy's, and I can already hear people typing on the keyboards right now. We're not telling you how it should be done. We're just gonna show you a few tips that we picked up through the years on how to utilize a pressure washer when cleaning a motorcycle. So, here we go. <laughs> As you can see, this bike needs a thorough rinse to loosen and get rid of all the majority of the dirt which is built up during the usage. And when you use the pressure washer, remember to keep a good distance, roughly around a meter away, and don't fixate on any particular part of the bike for too long because it may cause damage. This is the one piece of apparatus that pretty much everyone wants in their uh, motorcycle cleaning kit. It's the snow foam. Now remember, stay a good distance away. Don't fixate on any particular part for too long. Don't get too close. And make sure you smother the whole bike in the snow foam. And then crucially, you need to leave it for a particular amount of time before you rinse it off. Whichever snow foam you're using, make sure you check the details on what the best practice is. When rinsing the snow foam off, make sure you get into all the nooks and crannies but still keeping a safe distance because you don't want to leave any snow foam suds sitting there and doing some damage. Forget you snow foamer, this is the piece of equipment that everybody needs in their garage. This blower allows you to get to places that you wouldn't be able to dry with just a rag and elbow grease. It really helps getting rid of all the water on the bike and it won't leave any water in the nooks and crannies that you can't get to, which we all know may result in your bike being a little bit patinaed in the future. And then once your bike is fully dry, you can then add all your lotions and potions. During the winter, we tend to use ACF 50 because it gives a good coverage of the whole bike and protects it against all those winter elements. And then that's it, your bike's ready to get dirty again.